Now look up at me for a second. There's a lot of misunderstanding around this particular portion of scripture. I remember I was praying for a woman one time and she comes up to me and she says, I want you to pray for me. I said, what do you want me to pray? She says, pray, pray for healing in my eye. I said, okay, let's pray for healing in your eye. What's wrong with your eye? She says, nothing is wrong with my eye. I said, okay, so what do you want me to pray? She said, please pray for healing for my eye. I said, okay, let's pray for your eye. What's wrong with your eye? Nothing is wrong with my eye. Like 10, 15 minutes of this, guys, back and forth. Finally, I realized she doesn't want to say it because of that superstitious belief that if you say it, you cause it. Oh, you know, I'm, I feel my allergies are getting... Don't say that! You're speaking it into existence. Take this bottle of water. It's very hot as of late. You don't want to dehydrate. Don't speak that over me. My friend, if you don't drink the water, it doesn't matter if they speak it or not. Why? Because we've been conditioned, guys. We've been conditioned by religious thinking. And, and, and here's the thing. We don't even think it's religious. We think it's spiritual. 